Welcome to Church of the Chair, where if we wanted to read a Jack Reacher book, we'd read one by Lee Child. I'm your host, E, and today we're shooting our shot. If you're new around here, I will be spoiling all of Stephen King's work in this video series, so if you haven't read everything by him, I suggest you click away now. You've been warned. Today, we're talking about Billy Summers by Stephen King. So how does Billy Summers tie into the Stephen King universe and the Dark Tower series? Let's get into that. First off, we have one of my favorite Easter eggs in any Stephen King book, and that is the fact that Billy's mother worked on The Mangler, which comes from the short story of the same name, The Mangler, from Night Shift. I will be going back through and rereading The Mangler very soon, so check out the, uh, the eventual Redux video for Night Shift to find out if I actually find Billy's mother's name in that short story, because that would be hella cool in my opinion. Next up, we have a mention of Inside View. Once again, Inside View is all throughout the Stephen King universe. It is, of course, a tabloid magazine, most famous for one of its employees, Richard Dees, from the short story, The Night Flyer. But other than that, like I said, Inside View is all over the Stephen King universe and is even mentioned in The Dark Tower, so we have a hard connect. Next up, I want to share this clip of Grizzly Adams because he has something special to say. Next up, we have another connection to The Dark Tower by way of Stephen King himself, uh, referencing himself or putting himself in books as a character. Of course, he is a character in Saga Song of Susanna, but he references himself. He does not... Uh, he, he does not mention uh, that this is, this quote is from Stephen King, but if you listen to the audiobook, Stephen King actually quotes himself. They bring him in as a narrator for one line, and that line is, I always keep two things in mind, myself and the stranger. That's a Stephen King quote. Um, it, it was interesting that they would bring him in just for that little small section. I thought it was a really cool Easter egg to, uh, to add to the audiobook. And finally, before we get to viewer comments, I want to point out that a significant portion of this book takes place in Sidewinder, Colorado, and even the Overlook is mentioned. Both of those locations are, of course, in, they are the main location for The Shining. But on top of that, Billy ends up holed up in a cabin out in the mountains and there is a picture on the wall and in this picture the hedge animals seem to move. And now on to viewer comments. The first comment is from Charmaine Moore who brings up this. The fact that they do end up in Hemingford Home and Hemingford Home is all throughout the Stephen King universe, but as Charmaine said, it is the home of Mother Abigail and the adult version of Ben Hanscom, tying it into not only the stand, but also it. This next comment is from Layla, and she has this to say, which is very, very interesting, and I'm going to leave this up here for you guys to read for a second, and my response to Layla, because I find this ex exceedingly cool. I completely missed this. Next up, we have this comment from FTT, and I don't necessarily disagree with this. We all know that the gunslingers were prevalent at one point in time. Who's to say they couldn't be making a comeback and that Billy isn't one of them? Could he possibly be? Or have I forgotten the face of my father? Who knows? Thank you, Cy. Moving on. Christopher Wheeler had this to say. And I, honestly, I do not remember this part in the book. But I, I do like this. So I'm going to leave my response that I left way back years ago when I originally did the Billy Summers original theorist video. I'm going to leave my response up here also. That's all the time I have for you today. Did I miss anything? Do you have any corrections of anything I said in this video? Or do you have any theories of your own about how Billy Summers ties into the Stephen King universe and the Dark Tower series? If you do, leave it down there in them comments. But until next time, I'll hail the chair.